Hello and welcome back to Everything Gaming and today you join me for another Forzathon guide which is where I show you guys the quickest and easiest ways to complete this week's Forzathon challenge. Now this one called A New Generation wants you to own and drive any modern rally car to complete all the challenges with. But before we get stuck in I just want to ask you guys a quick question for a bit of a consensus. Um, have you guys recently been experiencing like technical problems, glitches, your game crashing a lot especially on the Xbox One X with Forza Horizon? four because i have and it's really weird it's not something that's happened to me at all except from the past couple of weeks i don't know just sort of throw it out there chances are it's just my bad misfortune um anyway let's get stuck into the challenges so first of all you want to pick yourself out a modern rally car now it's mainly subaru and pretzes and mitsubishi evos so of course i had to go for the 2004 mitsubishi lancer evo mr now i did create a tune for it it's called forzathon evo and there is a share code for it as well which is on your screen now now i would definitely recommend using a tune especially for the first and second challenge which we will go through next now the first challenge here wants you to reach a top speed of 185 mile an hour in your modern rally car so to do this i recommend heading over to the motorway that's where i always do these sort of speed challenges or anywhere that's got a nice long stretch of road so you can obviously hit your max speed in your modern rally car now this one with this tune is good for over 210 mile an hour but luckily we don't need to use it to its full potential all we need to do is hit 185 mile an hour and once you've done that stop and move on to the next challenge super super quick and super super easy now the next challenge here wants you to earn a total of 15 stars from danger signs in your modern rally car so again really really easy challenge here now to complete this one, first of all I filtered the map just to show danger signs and there's one really really good one. Now if you head over here just to the left of the Horizon Festival site there is a danger sign called Ambleside Edge. Now three stars on here is only 650 feet and to achieve that is super super easy. So you don't need a massive massive run up as long as you hit the jump doing over 135 mile an hour you're way surpass the target of 650 feet uh, you won't have to worry about anything super super easy and then you just turn around go back and do it all over again so there's no real trouble with this challenge like i said it does help to have a tune on your sort of modern rally car but for some of them it's not really essential but it will make your life a bit easier if you do now the final challenge here wants you to complete or achieve a podium finish even and a dirt racing series event at the gauntlet. Now for those of you who aren't aware the gauntlet is unlocked at level 15 or 20 of the dirt racing series. So if you don't have it if you've not sort of reached that level in the dirt series do not worry because you can still use this blueprint event that I have for you. Now the race itself is on the far right hand side of the map as you saw I just got a bit lost there but you can see it there by Bamba Castle. Now like I said I've created a custom blueprint event for you guys to use so even if you don't have the race unlocked you can use this one. So it's called quick and easy and the share code for this one is 130969017 and again like I said that's available for everyone to use. Now the best thing about a challenge like this is you do not need to do it on any sort of difficulty. So you can do it on amateur or pro, expert, it doesn't really matter, it's just a Forzathon event at the end of the day. And with this race the AI just drive off so you've got a straight run to the finish line and you've not got to spend sort of 8-10 minutes completing a massive race across the whole map. All you have to do is this which will take you about 11 seconds or so and then that's all of the Forzathon challenges complete for this week. Now if you're struggling with anything or you need help on anything just let me know down below in the comments and I will try and help you guys out as best as I can. Regardless of if it's about these challenges or some other ones just let me know and I'm always happy to help. If this video did help you out and you're new to the channel I would very much appreciate if you could subscribe and also dropping a like massively helps me out as well. But apart from that folks I want to wish you all the best, make sure you stay safe and take care.